Hey guys, I, uh, I'm looking for a new tent that I can use on this motorcycle ride and trying to find something small enough to fit not only in the on the bike but maybe even within my panniers here if possible. Um, all of the tents that I was able to find online were somewhere in the neighborhood of 20 inches, 22 inches wide or long, wide. Um, and uh, after a little bit of searching, I found one on Amazon. It's by a company called, ooh, what is it, Klost Nature? Klost Nature? It's kind of an odd one. Uh, not entirely sure how to say that properly. But the uh, the cool thing about it, not only was it inexpensive, around 70, 80 bucks, it is measuring about 15 inches all put together. So it fits in the bottom of my small pannier with room to spare i've got like three or four inches on the side there for more stuff so worst case scenario you know i put it on the back of the bike but best case scenario it goes inside the case and we're good to go i'll show you how it puts to get it gets all put together here in just a moment okay guys let's see how it all looks Some decent looking stakes. I don't know if you can see that. Not too bad. Aluminum, extremely light. See if we can remember how this thing goes back together. All in all, not bad. Went together pretty easy. It's a single person tent, nice and small. Now, what else can I say? Let's see how it goes back together. All right, easy. I think this is gonna work. So along the same lines as the small tent that I'm trying to pack into the panniers, if I can, I'm going with a extra small sleeping bag that I found made for the warmer weather, which is where I'm gonna be down there in you know, Southern California and Arizona, that kind of thing. Found this on Amazon as well, uh, made by a company called EcoPro, or well, spelled with two O's, so EcoPro interesting um it is about nine inches across without the uh cinch bag really being cinched down so we'll see if this thing is it's worth its weight yeah might be able to get it a little bit tighter than that yeah cinched it down about an inch and a half but makes it kind of an odd shape See what this thing looks like.
So, super light, very thin. Definitely not going to keep you warm when it's really cold outside. But for, you know, 90, 100 degree weather, hopefully it's a little cooler than that when I'm down there. But chances are it's going to be pretty darn hot. I think that'll do just fine. Got it back in there. Not very pretty, but I can make it work. <laughs> 